messed up, got abortions, killed them babies, and now they want kids and they can't have no more. Yeah, they got to do some appeasing. When you do that, when you have an abortion, there's a ritual that you have to do to appease those spirits. Mm-hmm. And it's serious. Very, very serious. And having an abortion, abortion. when you have an abortion, there's a ritual you have to do to appease those spirits. Ha having abortions, those spirits are very, very angry. Yep. Very, very angry. I'm not saying that you shouldn't have an abortion because there are many cases where it is not a bad or wrong thing to do but you have to follow it up with appeasement you know it's like if you accidentally hit somebody and they're hurt and damaged you still got to apologize even though it was an accident you, you still have well, to say, I'm, I am sorry. Else a person's spirit is angry and always sending you hate. Well, can I, can I, can I, can I chime in on that for a minute? Sure thing, please Go ahead. I'm going to say this. It is a bad thing to have an abortion. It's a bad thing because, see, when we realize that when that actual spirit chooses your womb to come through, that womb is chosen. You must not kill that baby. And, and, and some people don't understand it, but you're not supposed to kill that. You're not supposed to do that. You know, you know what, Nikki? certain wombs to come through. Wow. You know, you, you know what, that, that we live in a realm of a perpetual hell, right, ran by the devil. It has now arisen certain situations that shouldn't even happen in a civilization where people are civilized. Yeah. Things like of certain nature shouldn't happen, like a, a woman getting raped, right? You know yeah. what I'm saying? Or a father having sex with his daughter or a brother. Things of that nature should not happen. Now we have those type of things. So it's kind of hard to tell anybody not to have an abortion. The thing is, is to wipe out, we call civilization having the ability to wipe out those conditions where, where women and children can walk down the street unmolested. We don't have that anymore. Right? Now, the deep part about it is, right, the thing that killed black people the most is abortion. You can cry about white people all you want, yada, yada, yada. Cry about this, but the thing that kills black people the most, and this is a fact, right? That's, that's what? That's abortion. And we find all sorts of reasons. We find all sorts of reasons why we need to abort our children. It's crazy. It's crazy. Y'all look that up. Look that up and come back and tell me am I right or wrong. Yeah, the, and you so, know, so, so the part about aborting. Right, we keep aborting the rebirth of our ancient ancestral way of life. Right, we right. keep mis we keep miscarrying it, hmm. and we gotta stop that too. Gotta stop that. Yeah, you know, we gotta stop being hypocrites and parasites. We gotta, gotta stop, stop taking the funk, man. Well, I'm just a believer that if, it, if, it, if the baby's not supposed to come to that womb, if it, and most of the time, which is a true, which is true. A lot of times, if it was done in the incorrect way, most of the women will miscarry. That baby will automatically leave their womb. Nikki is a pro-life advocate. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because, that, you know, we must continue life. Yeah. We must continue yeah. life. Life is here to continue and continue and continue. So who are we yeah. to take the right of that life? You see what I'm Nine times out of ten, because of the way Mother Nature works and the Creator works, what happens is... If you have a situation such as a little girl getting raped or something like that, nine times out of ten, a lot of times nature will automatically uh, miss, let the baby be miscarried. I ain't buying that, Nikki. I ain't going to buy that one. Nah, I ain't going to buy that I didn't say all the time, Unc. I didn't say all the time. I didn't say all the time. I ain't, Sometimes I'm just, I'm, I ain't going to buy that. Well, you don't have to buy the one, but I, I know that the way nature works, it says life must continue. So if, it wasn't, if that womb wasn't chosen for that baby to come through, then it ain't happening. It is what it is. Yeah, but, but economy, economy, you don't have to buy it. Right it's now, okay to agree to disagree, huh? huh? <laughs> this economy is a bit tight right now. It's like I, I just can't afford it right now. I can't buy it. I can't afford it. I can't. Buy it. <laughs> a little bit too rich for my blood right now. Well, yeah, well, y'all better, y'all better use some condoms. <laughs> That's what y'all better do. <laughs> Y'all better use some condoms and keep it, keep it covered up. You know what? You, you Man, know what? You know what? Though. You know what? Though. You know. 
it's a little dangerous out there for a black man trying to establish himself like myself. Last night, I had a dream. There were truckloads of women. I got to go into hiding. <laughs> wow. They were coming wow. at me from every single corner. Mm-hmm. <laughs> got to run and hide. You got to be careful out there with that voodoo, you know. <laughs> Start over because you can't decide. How do you encode new information in your DNA? Probably How do you encode new information in your DNA? As long as you accept it as truth, it becomes a part of your DNA. If you believe it, it becomes a part of your DNA. That's why you have to be so careful with what you read. Mm-hmm. You know? All right. Okay, 215, you're on the air. I see you raise your hand. you have a question? Um, yes, I don't, y'all was just talking about um, the abortion and stuff like that. I just wanted to ask a question. Um, even you know, do y'all consider it as killing a child? Even when you um, like say you take the day after pill, do you still have to appease for that? Like say if you was late, so you basically probably was pregnant, but then you took the morning after pill. Do you have to appease for that? Uh, uh, I, I, I say it's life. I say it's life. Um, you say it's life. I say it's life. You, you have to know, it depends on how you feel. Like, you know, okay. if you felt that life there, uh-huh. and then you do it and it's gone, then yes. Outside of that, it's always good to, you know, go get a reading done and see. Because um, some, sometimes you might not be well enough connected to know and experience that, yep, I just ended a life. Okay, so, the reason you know, why this, I ate- uh huh. The reason why I asked is because at the time, I kind of figured that it was, and I did go get a reading done recently. Right. And um, when I got the reading done, the um, the guy that performed the reading asked me that I had three children. And right. I told him no, I had one child, and he right. said um, and he said well, you sure? He was like you only got one child. I said yes, only got one child. He said you ain't had no abortions, no nothing. And I told him I said yeah, I had one abortion. And one time I took the morning after pill. And I knew that I was pregnant when I took, like, I didn't know, like, confirmation right. with, um, with a test. But, like, when I had my son, when I got pregnant with my son, I knew I was pregnant before. And he was telling me, you're not pregnant when something is different with my body. Well, and, well my thing is, like, this is still life. I mean, from that, from, and see, women, we, it becomes just a zygote, which a lot of times for life. Uh, only white people. I have to concur, you know, as soon as that sperm hits that egg, man. Creation has begun. Hmm. The thought. How about Creation. the thought, Baba New? How about the thought? The thought. The thought. The sperm is the thought. Hmm. You mm. know, the sperm carries the man's DNA, the potency of the thought. And as soon as it hits that egg, right. creation begins. So, of course. You know. Right. And, and you know how you can prove that? Because if you take any of those stages... Out of that process, right? You won't have, you won't have, you won't have a human being. Yeah. And so, if that's the case, right? If, if you tamper with any of those stages, remove any of those stages, you will not have a human being. So that, so that must tell you, right, that all aspects of that, right, is life. Yeah, yeah you know, we, they're gonna come in with all types of uh, technical details to encourage people to. You know, do these things because remember, their agenda is to depopulate the planet. Right. Okay. Can I ask one more quick question? Well, to do the to do the appeasing, what do I have to do? Just pray to them, ask for forgiveness. You you need two dolls. You need to get two dolls, two baby dolls. Okay. Okay. uh And. You need to do a meditation with those dolls, light a candle, pray and ask for forgiveness. Give an offering as well. Tell them that you're sorry. Okay. All right. I'm a t- I got a question for you, Bob New, for the chat. And you got to keep read. those dolls, you know? I have to keep them? You have to keep them in a very, very safe and comfortable place.